New at 6, it's been a busy day for the Crimson Tide ahead of tomorrow's Rocket City Classic. Way 31 Sports Director Lyndon Blake has been with the team all day. She is live now with us at the VBC. Lyndon, what have the players been up to? Yeah, practice just wrapped up minutes ago for the big Rocket City Classic tomorrow. And even though school is out in Tuscaloosa, the Alabama men's basketball team went back in the classroom today at Whitesburg P8. Before the Alabama men's basketball team hits the court, they're hitting the books. Brought back the toys and the food for the feast. And he, what else y'all think he brought back? Reading to fifth grade students at Whitesburg P8. It was really fun. I, I've never really met Alabama basketball players. I've only seen them on TV, so it was a lot of fun. Speaking to children comes full circle for Jemison alum John Petty, who remembers Butler grad Trevor Lacey reading to Petty's class when Lacey played basketball at Alabama. That's like my brother now, um, and I always looked up to him, and he always. Just used to give me advice. So, yeah, I remember sitting in the same seat asking questions, wondering things, and now I'm living it. Fresh and glistening green, the biggest tree he had ever seen. To the 10 and 11 year olds, Bama players are larger than life. Did you ever go stand next to him? Yeah, I was I literally at their waist. <laughs> Germany Baker says the athletes Little motivate boy. her to follow her dreams. They inspire me that I. Could do anything that I put my mind to, and it inspired me that um, I can play basketball if I really wanted to. Petty and his teammates reading stories filled with Christmas cheer, but the message he wants the kids to remember is: No matter what what your dream is, don't give up on it. Um, he said, No matter if you don't got the finances, you don't got the friends, you don't have the family, you always got yourself. And when you have yourself and you believe in yourself, I mean, you can do anything you want. Now, John Petty is so excited to be back in his hometown tomorrow night playing with two of his teammates who are also from this area. The first game between UAH and Fort Valley State kicks off at 4.30, followed by the Alabama Liberty game at 7. Now, Way 31 is a proud sponsor of this event. I'll actually be emceeing the game tomorrow at 4.30, so if you haven't got your tickets, you can visit waytv.com. So excited, guys, for the Rocket City Classic. Reporting in Huntsville, Lyndon Blake, Way 31 Sports.